This video is not gonna be a list of trendy unitaskers or my favorite pot or pan. The home cook you're shopping for either already has all those things or isn't interested in them. Over the next few minutes, I'm gonna give you six gift ideas for the chef that truly has everything. All the ideas in this video are linked in the video description below, so if you find yourself being inspired, go ahead and check those out. Let's go. First, let's talk ingredients. I don't mean onions and potatoes. I mean high-end spices, oils, and other specialty items that will make your home cook's already delicious food even better. These products are right in the sweet spot of something that your home cook probably wouldn't buy themselves, but also won't break your bank account. Here are some ideas. Saffron. This earthy floral spice comes from crocus flowers primarily grown in Greece, Iran, Morocco, and India. The skillful addition of saffron will make any meal extra special. Vanilla beans. Using vanilla beans in lieu of vanilla extract really punches up the flavor and gives your baked goods that classic vanilla bean speckle. You can also use the pods to make homemade vanilla extract. By the way, these are best bought online where you can find a good quality for about a buck a bean. Grocery stores tend to inflate that price north of a thousand percent. High-end olive oil. I could probably do 10 videos just dedicated to the types, grades, certifications, and prices of olive oil. It is a broad and deep world. So unless you're already an olive oil nerd, don't get too stuck in the weeds on this. Just spend as much as you would on a nice bottle of whiskey and call it a day. Flavored salt. If you're gifting on a budget, smoked salt is a great option. There are tons of different varieties and you can usually get them pretty cheap. And finally, hot sauce. Keeping with the budget-friendly options, these are not just for Scoville addicts. I'm not really that into spicy food, and even I have four different types of spicy sauces in my refrigerator right now. Hot sauces are a great shortcut to adding flavor to a dish or jazzing up some leftovers. The next idea is almost certainly something your home cook already has, a microplane. I find myself reaching for this tool every day, be it to zest some citrus, grate some nutmeg, or get a fine dusting of parm over my pasta dish. But did you know that microplane should be replaced annually? If the grater in your home cook kitchen has been there for a while, they will not believe the difference between their old standby and the fresh, new, sharp one that you gifted them. Next, we have a gift that may not be super fun, but is definitely worth giving. Reusable storage bags. I know plenty of eco-conscious cooks who want to eliminate single-use plastic from their kitchens, but the prices of those storage containers can be prohibitive. I guarantee a new set would be appreciated, and it's good for the environment. The home cook who already has everything definitely has all the knives they could ever want. But you know what they don't have an infinite supply? time. So save them from time working away on a whetstone and gift them a knife sharpening service. Mail-in sharpening services are quick, convenient, and affordable. For my next idea, I have a little story. About a year ago, my girlfriend gave me her ancient iPad along with a magnetic tablet stand that can go on the fridge or just sit on the countertop. While this tablet is so old, it can't even download the Google app, having a dedicated screen that can pull up any recipe on the internet is so much more convenient than using my phone. This is the modern day version of a recipe book stand. As demonstrated by my story, you don't need anything special here, so I'm recommending the very inexpensive seven inch Amazon Fire tablet and the same magnetic stand that I have. Before I get to my final gift suggestion, if you liked any of the gift ideas I've given you so far, I'm gonna go ahead and ask you to hit the like button and share this video with someone you know who has a home cook in their life. Christmas, after all, is about sharing and shameless plugs. Moving on, if all else fails, or if you're just watching this at the last minute and don't have time to order anything, I'll share with you one of my most favorite gifts I can get in my kitchen, a nice bottle of wine. I know it's a little common, I guess, but just like popcorn pairs so well with a good movie, a glass of Pinot Noir is the perfect thing on the counter while I'm cooking. This is also a great gift idea because of the variability in price, so you can choose what level you want to give. Well, that's it. I hope one or two of these ideas were helpful to you. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and have a happy holiday. Thank you.